Good morning class. In the previous lesson, we have just started a new chapter that is five kingdom classification. And in that chapter, we have learned about classification that it is grouping based on similarities. We have also come to know about taxonomy, branch of biology, the science of classifying, grouping and naming of organisms. Binominal Nomenclature, the system for naming organisms by structure, creative a Carl Linnaeus. We have also come to know about hierarchy of classification. A very important thing that we have come to know in our previous class, the grouping of organisms into kingdoms is based on three factors, cell type, whether they are prokaryotic, eukaryotic, cell number, unicellular or multicellular and feeding type whether they are autotroph or heterotroph. We have just started with Kingdom Monora, the characteristics features. We have learned about Protista. Now class today we will be learning about the fungi, Kingdom Fungi. Kingdom fungi characteristics eukaryotes can be unicellular or multicellular consumers that do not move decompose dead organisms decompose dead organisms or waste products example mushrooms molds and mildew you have it over here so they belong to kingdom fungi Next, another kingdom that is Kingdom Plantae. Now, children, we are going to learn about this in detail. Kingdom Plantae, they are stationary, multicellular eukaryotes, photosynthetic, very important product, property of characteristic feature of Plantae. Autotrophs, they make their own food, a very important characteristics of plantae are they are photosynthetic autotropic so different examples of plants these are the examples next we have is kingdom animalia multicellular consumers that eat and digest other organisms. They are heterotrophs, can be herbivores, carnivores, or omnivores. Example animals. So, these are the three kingdoms that we have learned for today. So, let us revise Kingdom Monera. Kingdom Monera characteristics can be prokaryotic, prokaryotic organisms. Monarians are unicellular, are heterotropic. Two kinds of organisms are bacteria and cyanobacteria. Kingdom Protista, eukaryotes, uni and multicellular, live in moist environments. Most are simple, microscopic, mobile. Example, paramecium, euglena and algae. Very important characteristic feature once again according to the cell type, cell number and feeding type. Hierarchy of classification children, kingdom, phylum, class, order, family, genus and species. So children, this is all we'll be learning for today.